G'day YouTubers, Pirate Pete coming at you from a pretty balmy overcast sort of Thursday night here in Sydney with a, I, I've got an unboxing today, I'm pretty excited about it so I'm not going to waffle on, I'm just going to get straight into it. Alrighty, so I've got a couple of things to to share with you in the, in this video, I've um, probably got myself what I consider my own um, personal point of view, a most exciting uh, package that I've ordered so far to date. Um, it did come from um, it came from Melbourne, this package from a, um, a dealer called Gold Stackers, which is, uh, uh, for those of you who watch uh, Numi Stackers um, videos, you might have seen he was in, in Melbourne on holiday and he, uh, well he put me onto this through his video, uh, so very grateful for that. I've um, checked out what they've got on their website and um, they actually had a, a collection of coins which are kind of hard, hard to come by. They're probably pretty easy in the States for folks to get, um, but they're not that easy to find here in Australia. So I was kind of kind of excited by what they had and I, I did get the lot. So um, I went and ordered um, as, as many of the coins or the rounds that they had in this box. Now I've already started opening this. This, this package came so well packed that it would have been a four hour video if I was trying to cut it open and uh, unbox it fully in front of you here. So I've spared most of that grief for you. I've partially unboxed it. I've had a look at some of the stuff, but I haven't really opened it all up. So I'll, I'll share that all with you um, now. But um, some of it I've already opened. Some of it you can see I haven't yet managed to cut my way through. So we'll do that in this video. But this is, this is uh, the first thing that I uh, picked up, which was um, the 10 ounce um, 2015 kookaburra. I'll try and get it in a shot where it's not too glary for you. But um, 10 ounce being the, I guess my favorite size, um, bullion um, bars, I thought might as well get it in the coin as well. And um, these um, anniversary edition uh, coins, I'm, I'm kind of expecting will do quite well over time, but um, I've got my eye on the one ounce um, coins of, uh, of this particular year as well, and the 2016 coin for the Kookaburra for me really appeals, I think it's got a great design, so I'm looking to um, accumulate a lot of those, I, I might end up trying to pick up a, a, maybe a hundred or, or two hundred of those um, in the next few months, so uh, keep an eye out for those videos, but I, I bought five of these, so there's two more in that one there. I'll try and get into that without taking too long. But uh, you might have seen Numi Stacker's video where he was in Melbourne and uh, I think he was sort of talking about the Back to the Future um, cars that the Perth Mint was at the time making available and um, I think he bought I don't know, he probably bought about 300 of them by the looks of it. He bought certainly a big box of them um, from this place in Melbourne. Um, and they are pretty good priced. I think you, if you've seen his video, you might recall he was saying that they were, for bullion anyway, they were about as competitive as you could find in, in, in Oz. And um, I could vouch for that. They are pretty good. There is, there is one place here in Sydney which um, I think I can find some good deals on the 2016 Kookaburras at the moment, which maybe even beat them, but um, but they're still really good value. And I've got to say the service was really good. And the packaging, as you can tell, because I'm struggling to get into it, is unbelievable. So, so another one of those, two of those. And two more. So I, I bought five of those, or 50 ounces in total. All right, so another couple of those. So there's five in total. I'll lay them all out at the end. And this is the one that I find they are hard to come by. So we got, uh, well, I got 10 of these. I think you'll know what's inside once you see that one there. A 
And these are just, uh, I think, my absolute favourites at the moment, these rounds. They're just, um, maybe because I'm a pirate, Pete, I don't know, but I just love these pirate coins. And uh, this is the one that's got the, I think it's called the siren. It's just amazing detail on those coins, on those rounds. They're just really cool. And I can't get enough of watching these on everyone's videos. So if you do get them, keep sharing those videos because I just can't get enough of watching those. So in total, I bought 11 of these. I've got 10 to keep in, in that little box there, but um, i got one more just so I've got something to stare at. That one I'll keep for myself. And then I bought three uh, Cleopatras as well. I thought um, they just look really cool. So I wanted to pick up a few of these. I think one, one that I'll keep and um, the rest I think I'll, I don't know, I'll probably sell them over time somewhere on eBay or trade them for something else. But just amazing. I think, is it Provident Metals who make these? They're just fantastic. Just hits the light at every angle. It's amazing. Amazing design. So, three of those. And... This one over here I picked up was a, I'm just building up a bit of a collection here of these European Privy Mark series. They're um, not particularly exciting, but I've just, I've, there's 15 in total in that set, and uh, I found myself with half the set already, so I thought, well, all right, I might as well try and see if I can collect all of them. But this one here is the, um, I don't know if you can see that, the Colosseum there. So this is the Italian privy marked of the kookaburras. So I'll, I'll see if I can get all 15. If I do, I'll just probably flip all 15 at once. But a um, little bit of a challenge for myself to try and get the... Uh, I think I've got about seven of them now. So I'll try and get the last eight over time. So here they all are in total. And there's the 50 ounces over there. And uh, I've also just got a bit of a feedback on my first eBay selling experience. I've managed to sell a, it was a 2004 um, proof coin, a kookaburra proof, um, which pretty much just sold like a hot cake. Uh, I think somebody snapped that up within the first day that it was listed and um, I think I made a, about $50 profit on it so I, I really did it more for the experience I've never sold on eBay before and uh, I think my feedback is maybe not news to anyone who's experienced with eBay but it just really sucks I've got to be honest um, you know they take almost half half of half the profit it's um, the fees are extraordinary and I'm just thinking to myself there has to be a better alternative out there. I haven't found it yet, but I'm sure either it exists or uh, somebody's going to create an alternative pretty soon because uh, it just doesn't look like eBay are interested in small players that are you know, just out to sell small uh, volumes of things. They're probably more interested in large traders. So it doesn't look uh, cost effective to me, the eBay market, the model anymore. Um, so got to live with it for the time being but I'm definitely looking for any alternatives out there so if you do know of any alternatives um, share that info out because I'm all ears on that one um, it uh, just sort of sucks that you're giving away I think I had to pay uh, what was it 20 probably $20 in um, in uh, commissions and I don't even know what you'd call it 20, $20 to eBay and then you pay uh, I think it was about $12 on shipping as well so you're spending 30 odd dollars and 
50 of it's for yourself and it just doesn't really add up to me but uh, I don't know that was that was my impression of it but um, I'll still have to do it because I, I think eBay is a viable channel to sell over time but uh, it just sucks that's my opinion anyway so um, that's all I've got today I've, I've got um, a few more that I've ordered uh, which is coming hopefully next week and uh, I'm probably as equally excited about that order as I was with this one um, but um, we'll just have to wait until next week to see what that is but um, it's something that I thought was really cool and uh, I had to snaffle up as many of those as I could but um, I'll share that when that comes out probably next week sometime so um, until I see you next um, as always just uh, uh, hit, hit like subscribe and uh, Keep sharing your own videos and uh, we'll catch you on the next one. Cheers. Now, if you like this video and you'd like to see more just like it, why don't you show your support by joining the crew and we'll explore gold and silver together.